This is one that, you know, um, you just it keeps you up at night, you know. Um, but we got to the picture we wanted. We got the Steph Draymond uh, pick and roll at the top. We had good spacing. Um, you know, the 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 I thought maybe we were going to get get um, Draymond on the roll with the spacing on either side and get a good shot because they doubled Steph. And uh, but but he didn't. You know, he just couldn't get it to Draymond in that situation. They they did a good job of doubling him. And uh, you know, when the play's over, then you're like. Yeah, you know, um, could have taken a timeout, and that's um, it's it's a it's always a difficult decision down the stretch. But um, I've seen those guys convert in that situation a million times, and like I said, we we got to the picture we wanted eventually, um, just didn't pan out. Hey, Steve, it seemed like J.K. caught the ball just crossing half court there and might have had a lane to the rim. Did you think that maybe the guys were a little I'm too... I'm sorry, say it again. It seemed like on that final possession after Herter missed those two free throws, Clay got the Clay got the rebound, pitched it ahead to J.K., yeah. J.K. caught past half court. It seemed like you might have had a lane to the rim as the Kings were getting back. Do you think maybe you guys might have been a little too deferential uh, to getting the ball to Steph there? I haven't seen the play um, yet. I haven't watched the replay. Um, but... Um, you know, J.K. is—he's uh, a young player. He had a phenomenal night tonight again. This is um, just a string of great ga- games from him. And um, so, you know, we went to him the, the the possession before down on the block, and and uh, so he's really um, earning, you know, the trust of his teammates. And and uh, it's a, he's he's getting better and better. So, you know, I haven't watched that play. You know, there's always stuff you could have done, you know, this or that, but um, he was he was phenomenal tonight. And you're happy with them getting to the 1-5 pick and roll in the second year. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's, you know, we've been doing this for a long time, and those guys know exactly, you know, what we're trying to accomplish. And like I said, you get the defense scattered. Uh, the, you know, maybe the time to take the timeout would have been earlier when, um, when we didn't have the spacing, maybe, you know, 12, 13 seconds left. Uh, but once we got the ball out to Steph and uh, Draymond stepped into the pick and roll, I like that picture. And that's kind of, you know, what we've done for a long time. And like I said, they made a good defensive play and, um, you know, they, they deserve the win. Steve, it looked like Steph, uh, you know, wasn't sure what he wanted to do, step back, pass. Is it odd to watch? I mean, there's been a lot of games where your star players, your guys that won championships, have made mistakes down the stretch. Is it is it odd to watch? Do you figure they'll it'll click at some point like it always has? Or is, is something just different about them and maybe this year, maybe the league or whatever? Honestly, um, you know, w- w- the, the difference is every game is close now. You know, I think in the past... Um, we had uh, we had plenty of games like this where you know we um, you know miss a shot at the end or don't execute and and um, but you know because every game is tight and our record is what it is I think there's just a spotlight on every single uh, late game situation and um, I think we've still you know played more clutch games than any team in the league um, and so when we when we don't convert it's it's just exposed because it's um, you know we are where we are and we're you know trying to fight our way into the playoffs and uh, but we you know those type of situations in the past, we didn't always convert. We had plenty of nights where we didn't uh, execute and, um, you know, came out on the wrong end of things. 